Hello guys, welcome back to another video on Terraria Journeys and Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. So last episode we finished off still as Jonathan in obviously land of 1.4 and more specifically where we finished off it was after our very dangerous yet pretty fun adventure over in the good old desert. We've explored the desert quite a bit actually. We've explored yeah this much, it's not actually that much uh, kind of yeah 30 minutes kind of yeah we didn't really do that much exploring but a few more npcs have moved in the zoologist has moved in actually that was two episodes ago um but the painters moved in yeah now we can go and use the desert pylon which is quite great and yeah everything is good we also have this thing magic so you can teleport to the ocean so that's quite good we can go to the ocean to the desert or back home whenever we want to but and yeah still everything's fun Anyway, today what I want to do is, as you know, I want to go and explore the jungle. We haven't done that yet, and I do want to explore the jungle. Issue is, the jungle is a very dangerous place. I don't know if I'm strong enough to explore the jungle. The jungle might be simply just too strong. It might be just too dangerous. The enemies in there might be too strong. So, there's only one way to find us. That's what we're going to do today. That's what we're going to pretty much do. We're going to go into the jungle. We're going to explore it. Uh, see, journey if I'm strong enough. If I'm too weak, then we're not going to bother. We're just going to have a quick lock. And journey also the other objective, which is going to be another primary objective. It is to go and construct a jungle home. Because we already have one jungle NPC. We already have one jungle NPC. It is the painter, he lives with us. The other two, the witch doctor, which comes in after defeating the queen bee. And the drad, which moves in after defeating Skeltron. The brain of Cthulhu and the of Cthulhu. They're gonna come in soon. So there's three NPCs that like to live here. One of them is already here. So we might as well already go and build him a home just so the other two guys already have a home for them when they arrive. Good. So yeah. Generally, um, the angler is living where he wants to and there's already home for the other two uh, d d d um, ocean NPCs. The jungle does not house in there, but we're going to build one today. The desert, already one NPC is living there. The painters are going to go to the, the jungle today. And the demolitions, we still have to go and build a home to the un in the underworld, but well, near the underworld. Well, yeah, no, we have to build a home on the ground, but we're going to build his home near the underworld, just so we have an easy, quick way to get down there. So, we, before we do that, we have to go and, first of all, actually reach the underworld, so we can carry on working on that later. And, yeah, these, and the current, and the current five NPCs that like to live with us, the four of them are going to live in, going to be living here permanently, and the nurse is going to move when we get the hollow. That is the plan. Also, this dude, the Jim Mulligan, the uh, golfer he moved in last time, he's very happy here. Nothing better than having all the space to yourself. He likes the forest and study features. He always yeah, he's always happy that he's with her. So he's really quite happy living here, which is quite good. His prices should be lower. You look, he sells the gold he sells the pilot for eight gold. When I think the merchant was selling it for like nine gold and like few, you know, copper. Let's see. Your prices. Yeah, look, eight gold fifty silver. So the um yeah. The golf keeper is selling it for a bit cheaper because he very he likes it here. Yeah, we already have one, so we don't need to buy one, but yeah. I do want to go and maybe buy the lawnmower from you. It's only 80 silver. Like, it's literally only 80 silver, yeah. Moss, pure and hollow. The grass mode, grass reduces enemy spawn chance. That sounds great. 80 silver, give me that. Uh, what I want to do is simply want to go and... Look at this. <laughs> That's so cool. What I want to do is I want to go and mow this grass because this grass keeps on... This is supposed to be the golfing field. This area is supposed to be the golfing field. The golfer is supposed to come out here and do some golfing when he wants to. But the grass keeps on growing here, which gets annoying. So let's mode this grass, shall we? There we are. Look at this. This looks beautiful. Wowee. Look at this grass. Oh, yeah. That is some very nicely mowed lawn. Nice. So that's cool. We have now mowed this grass. Good. So this grass is indeed lawn mowed. No grass should grow on here, first of all. And secondly, I don't think any... I don't think, yeah, no grass would spawn on here, and, well, no enemies will spawn here, which is quite good. So, if there's a blood moon, the enemies will only, will only well, no, like, they can still spawn in here, but... Whatever, this is just, yeah, cool grass, looks better, looks nice. I don't really know what to do with this lawnmower now, because I do want to go and leave, I don't want to leave this, because, you know, I like when the grass is growing here, because it looks nice. Who wants a lawnmower? <laughs> I don't know, I'm going to fucking it here. Is a lawnmower, I don't think I have a chest for lawnmowers. You know, it's just gonna go into explosives because, you know, lawnmowers can explode. Anyway, yeah, that's that. So, we have journey, we have three objectives, three things that I want to do. Well, four things. I want to fight the Eye of Cthulhu, but that's later because you need to build an arena. I want to get out to the underworld and build a home for the, um, for the demolitionist. But so you can do that pr pretty now. And I also want to go and explore the jungle, which you can do probably right now. And I also want to go and build a jungle home, which you can also do today. So, just go to the jungle. Let's just build a jungle home. And just let's just simply just deal with all the jungle stuff. 
And then I guess you go and probably carry and explore the jungle and desert next few episodes. You can reach the underworld soon and you can fight the Eye of Cthulhu very soon. After we build an arena, of course. For now, let's quickly go and make our way into the... Where are we going? Yeah, the desert. I mean, the jungle. Let's go to the jungle. But first, let's go to the desert because, you know, how did you spawn? We're in a town. Whatever. Let's, yeah, let's go. Uh, yeah, let's teleport to the desert. I could walk to the desert, but it's way faster if I teleport. So that's what we're going to do. Teleport here, then we can go and run from here to the desert. It's going to be faster. Anyway, yeah. Let's go. We have much to do today, so let's get to it. Alright, so this is where we tried to go and battle the Afkafulu last time, but as you know, we miserably failed. So, yeah. It's a bit of a, you know, the eye has killed me like five times and I've killed it like none. So, yeah. We're still working on that, let's just say. But we're getting close. Anyway, yeah, let's just currently, yeah, we're currently still on our, yeah, we're still, we're still working on, you know, pretty much beating the Afkafulu. I need to build an arena first, so, you know, we're still, oh god, we're still working on, you know, that. Whatever. Let's make our way over to the beautiful... No, why did I jump? Let's make our way over to the beautiful uh, jungle. It just changed to daytime. The jungle's a bit safer in, ju in the daytime. The jungle's a very dangerous place. That is the reason why I don't really want to go underground. The overground jungle, we can probably survive. But the underground jungle might have some difficulties with that. So, yeah, we'll see. For now, let's go. I guess you can probably go and build a home first. Just so you can already have that there. And then you can worry about exploring the underground. I want to go and build a, I want to build a house on that big, huge, you know, flat area near the, whoops, near the, um, near the entrance to the underground. So that's what we can do. And I just need to go and flail these guys to death. There we are. Yeah, this flail ain't really that good. I could upgrade it. I could, you know, upgrade it. I could, you know, spend like 99 torches and upgrade it into the flame one. I think that's what I might do. I might buy like a few torches and upgrade this. Also, I want to fight the torch god. But our last, oh, I cannot see a thing. Our last attempt to fight in the torch god didn't go so well. Why? Because he didn't spawn. <laughs> I placed down a hundred torches like we were supposed to. He didn't spawn. And yeah, that's quite bad. I believe it, I think I think we have to fight him on the ground for that to work. I don't know, I'm not 100% sure. When I find a, a big spot for me to place a hundred torches, we can try that. But generally, yeah, it's not a priority. Fighting the torch god would be like, you know, a secondary objective, but I do want to do it sometime soon. Anyway, right here. This is where I want to go and build a home. I want to go and build a home right here. Pretty cool, nice, flat area. So, yeah, let's go and build it right here. Start chopping down these trees and build a home. I don't really know what design I want to go and do, but, well, whatever works, I guess. Oh, God, but the bees. No, bees. Ah, oh, the bees came out of the trees. God, no, that could happen. Yeah, that would need to blaze the trees. The trees are not only sway in the wind, but the trees also attack you sometimes because, you know, everything tries to, kill, tries to kill you in this world. Anyway, we have cut down a tree without dying. So that's, you know, the first part of the, you know, the job done. Now I need to go and, uh, I need to get out of here. Anyway, yeah, I also need some better weapons because when, yes, my armor may be decent. I have, what, golden armor? Golden armor is pretty good. So my armor is decent, but I need better weapons because my golden staff, it just, my ruby staff just ain't cutting it. Like, yeah, it works, but it's not that good. I would prefer something better. Hello, Pinky. Where did you come from? So, I probably would want something better. Like, my grenades aren't that good. So, you know. I need a better weapon, basically. I need a weapon. So, you can work on that, I guess. So much suit. Whatever. Uh, yeah. Let's uh, start working on building home, shall we? How big do I want this home? Big enough to house some people. This little, I guess, island, you could say, should be big enough. So let's just get to it. I only have 72 rich mahogany, which ain't close to enough, but it's gonna have to work for now. No, put that over there. There we go. Now, uh, yeah, I also don't have a workbench, which means we're gonna have to go and craft on, and workbenches cost 10 wood, which is quite expensive, but that's fine. Anyway, uh, let's just go and first of all build the bottom floor of the house, see how big we want the house, and then deal with, you know, the rest of the stuff. There's so many slimes over here, Jesus Christ. I think there's less slimes during a slime rain, goddammit. Okay, you can die. There we are, and you can also die. Okay, there's so many. I need to go a bit like a wall. I, I just need to build something that will go and protect me from these slimes. And bats and every other living creature in the jungle. Because there's so much stuff over here. Oh my god. Jesus, this is like some kind of like event where I'm fighting off enemies. Alright, how big do you want this house? Pretty big. I think we're going to have like two NPCs on the bottom floor and one up top. Because I haven't built that, that, I haven't built that design house yet. And I don't know. Yeah. Okay. That. Okay. Now, um... Yeah, this, see, we do need to go and fit two NPCs down here, so this needs to be pretty big. Stop, die, oh my god. Why do I have a zombie arm as a sword? What the hell? Okay, you can just, all of you can die. Thank you. And now we're gonna build, it like, a few more. There you go. That should be big enough to go and house two NPCs. Good. Now, yeah, that'll be that. Good, you can, oh my god, just die. Oh, stop, no, stop. Okay, fine. 
One, two, three, four. There we are. Like, I'm not gonna die. These guys aren't strong enough to kill me, but they're strong enough to go and annoy the hell out of me. Stop, 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 stop. Okay, they are definitely gonna kill me. Yep, here I was saying I was super strong, but oh my god. I hate jungle bats. No, no, I have money on me. Teleport. Go. No! I just dropped four gold coins for the love of God. Respawn me, goddammit. I got killed by a snatcher. Okay, well, at least we built a bit of a house. Ah, I won't be able, I even won't be able to use the desert, no. I won't be, I won't be able to use the jungle pylon because we only, we're only gonna have one NPC living there for now. Which is quite annoying. Oh well. Well, whatever, we can, I guess we can move a different NPC into there. That's fine. We can see the golfer is definitely using the, you know, the field that we gave him. He definitely likes the spot, which is good. Anyway, we're back home. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm really too happy being here. Anyway. How much money do I have on me? None. I lost all my coins. I literally dropped everything. Oh, that's not that's not nice. Hook, uh, just just oh, I don't like. Hooks. Okay, let's let's just go back to the goddamn what is it? Jungle, shall we? Yeah. Also, yeah, I'm gonna take my piggy bank. We kind of might need that. And also, I'm gonna take my workbench because we're gonna need to go and you know, we're gonna need to go and craft some things using our workbench. It's better to go take workbench than you know, craft one. Save some more wood. Anyway, to the jungle we go. <sighs> ah yes, the jungle. We have arrived. Now, let's see how long we're gonna last before we die this time, shall we? Let's uh, spawn in this fool. And yeah, I guess you could cut down some more um, well, these trees because I've kind of already got a lot of wood and I need quite a lot of wood. Let's just cut down some trees early. Oh god, it's a balloon slime. Okay, you know. Oh, why did you pop him, you goddamn son of a gun? Okay, no, just stop. Okay. Mahogany tree. Oh, there's more. Oh my god, stop. Bird thing, deal with him. Okay, I need my thing. Stop. No, stop. 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 Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Okay, anyway, uh, those trees, they're too small to cut down, so I'm not gonna get anything out of those. Stop. Oh my god, literally everything is trying to kill me in this goddamn jungle. Even the slimes, because my, keep on, my thing keeps on attacking the slimes, and oh god, stop. Stop, stop, just stop. Just all of you, just stop. Stop, stop, oh my god, just die. Oh, Jesus Christ. I think, yeah, I think building this house first is a good idea. Why? Because I'm gonna have a place to hide myself from these fools. Whatever. Let's cut down some trees, build a house, I'll see you when I get more progress. Alright, I'm back, and on my way back I cut down pretty much every single tree that I cut off. I kept a few trees because they were just too small and there was too many enemies surrounding them. Anyway, we've got 377 rich mahogany wood. This should be enough. Also got a mango, because who doesn't like a mango? You know, let's just eat a mango. Anyway, yeah. 377 wood, this should be enough to finish off this house, hopefully. Anyway, yep, yeah, one, two, three, four over there, and then one... Two, three, four over here, good. The enemies are already coming back. I don't know what the hell these fools came from, but it's already on attack. Got them parade of these cretins trying to kill me. It's kind of annoying, you know. Oh, I got, uh, forgot about my money. Okay, these fools picked up my money, so that's cool. I got that back. And that's the snatch that have killed me, so yeah. Yay, revenge. Whatever. Now, uh, let's place down our piggy bank and also put our money away because I have a lot of money that I don't want to lose. There you oh, what? There's a four, fourth pinky today. That literally is our fourth pinky today. I want to kill it because pinkies all most of the time mean money. And I like money. No, stop. Pinky, you can just die. Where the hell are all these balloon slimes coming from? Alright, come here. Stupid son of a pink. That's a great insult. Okay, nope, you can die. There we are. Thank you. Give me all your money. And your pink gel is quite useful, actually. Makes bouncy bombs. Bouncy bombs are very cool. Nah, put that away. Oh, my God. This is going to take so much time. Alright, I need some doors. Let's quickly go and craft ourselves some doors. There we are. Bam, bam. Two doors. Probably gonna need no actually two should be enough actually. Whatever. Doors here they come. Now we're gonna go and build uh yeah oh my god no stop 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 oh there's so many slimes oh for the love of god okay birdie can you like deal with all these guys yeah I'm trying to build a home but I'm kind of like it's gonna be failing okay um yeah I'm just gonna carry on building and I guess I'll see you when I make some more construction progress oh ah, look at that one of these stupid bats dropped me a depth meter that's pretty cool uh, it's useless, but still pretty cool. Oh no. I was just building a house, and we got a blood moon. That's quite bad. Let's quickly block the doors. Because when, yes, these guys might be able to break doors, well, they won't be able to get in. Anyway, yeah, this is my progress so far. House looks pretty good. I've built this side, I've built this. I pretty much got the structure built. Now I gotta go, I gotta build the walls and the furniture. But generally, everything's coming along pretty well. So, yeah, well, that's how the house looks like. I'm pretty proud of it. Anyway, I would like to put a torch on the roof, but it's kind of hard. But yeah, Journey, this is how the house looks now. Pretty good. I like it. And yeah. I'm not done yet, but I am very close. I guess I'm going to carry on building. And uh, yeah, 
I guess I'm gonna have a whole huge zombie horde to fend off. Anyway, yeah. I'll see you soon. Right, well, I think that the house is complete. Beautiful, isn't it? Oh, it is indeed. So, yeah, that's how it looks like. A journey has, like, fallen stars over. A journey has, yeah, like a bottom area for, like, two NPCs. This room, this is where Leonardo, the painter, is going to be living. Yep, that is for the painter. And this is going to be for just, like, it's probably the witch doctor. And up here, the dryad can live up here. So, yeah, journey, pretty cool house. Two rooms downstairs, a room up here. A nice, pretty cool staircase. And, yeah, journey chairs everywhere, lights. And I have, actually, two tables in here. And that's because I accidentally crafted an extra table, and I didn't really feel like dumping the table, so I just put two tables down because, you know, why not? Anyway, yeah, so that's that done. I had two objectives today. Explore the underground jungle, build a house. The house is built, the house is here. But now I've got to go and explore the underground. And yeah, that's all fine and all, but I don't really know how to get out of here. I think I'm just going to go, open the door and run. Uh, yes. <laughs> uh, give me that, thank you. Yeah, you're going to need you all come in. Come in, all of you. i got to murder all of you, actually, firstly. Get in. I do want to actually go and kill a bunch of droplets. I can go get myself like that weird floating piggy bank thing. Because I do want, you know, well, I do just want one of those. Stop. So if you go and get out of here before, you know, the zombies come and oh, break the doors open again. Uh, come here, yep, you can also die. Oh, there's so many of these weird guys. Yeah. Uh, okay, I didn't really consider how many of these guys there were out here. Okay, yeah, this is bad. This is real bad. No, stop. Okay, stop. 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 Oh my god. Okay, no, no, no. Go right now. Teleport out here. Go, 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 go. Home. Wowie, whoo, whoo, got us something. Where's the nurse gone? Is the nurse... No, where's the nurse? The nurse has absolutely vanished. Uh, that's a trouble. Did a nurse move in here? Oh, the nurse did. Why did the nurse move in there? I will never know. Anyway, yeah, everyone's gonna get raided and killed now, so I gotta get out of here. Is this missing a table? Oh, yeah, of course I destroyed the table, didn't I? Yeah, guide, you may want to kind of, like, run for your life, you know? I'm just saying. Um, yeah, the nurse can live here. Good. Uh, yeah, can I use this or are these out of commission because it's a blood moon? Okay, I can use those. Perfect. Okay, good. The house is kind of being destroyed, but that's fine. I just spun around in circles because I got confused because of that weird confusion thing. Whatever. Let's go run to the jungle, shall we? Yeah, I'm gonna die. Oh my god, I just realized how weak I was. Okay, now let's actually go back home quickly. Yeah, okay, let's go home. And nurse, heal me. Good. Let's close these doors as well. There you are. No, stop. Close the door. Yeah. Uh, blood moons are nice. The guy took us some hits. Oh god, okay, whatever. Let's just journey here. Go, yeah. Okay, let's go over here. There you are. Good. Let's go to the underground jungle, shall we? Yeah, I guess we could explore the desert. No, let's explore the jungle. The jungle might be too difficult for us. The jung if the jungle is too difficult, we're not going to bother. We, ca we can come back to the jungle after we defeat the Af Kafulu. I do plan on defeating the Af Kafulu soon, but yeah. Let's just go to the jungle, see if I'm strong enough to defeat it. If not, we're going to bother if he has it, that's cool. And yeah, generally I have to build an arena soon. I don't know where I want to build my arena, but probably somewhere in the, um, probably somewhere, you know, in the good old, uh, jungle. I mean, you know, actually, I'm going to build it in a desert. I always build it in a desert, so I just build it in a desert. So yeah, we're going to build our arena in the desert, like usual. And uh, yeah, and that's going to be that. So we can build an arena soon. Oh my god, I kind of jump up there for some other reason. Stop, stop. Oh yes, it's daytime. Thank the gods, it's daytime. Oh, I hate blood moons. Okay, that was very short, blood moon. Who are we? Anyway, that's that. Anyway, yeah, as I was saying, um, uh, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, we're gonna build our arena here, we're gonna build arena in the desert. I always build our arena in the desert, so we're gonna build an arena in the desert this time as well. So, yeah, we're gonna do that soon. So, yeah, we're gonna fight the Afkafulu. We're gonna fight the Afkafulu very soon. But as I said, we're gonna build an arena first, so we, we can build an arena next, uh, maybe not next episode, but just soon in the desert. We're gonna fight the Afkafulu after the arena is built. We can fight the brain of Kafulu also pretty soon. We can break some shadow. Or we can break some crimson orbs in the, cr in the crimson incredibly soon. Maybe even next episode. And I generally want to go and explore the desert and the rest of the jungle. I want to explore the rest of the desert and the jungle today. So for further ado, let's go. There's two entrances. There's actually two entrances into the jungle. One entrance over here and one entrance over here. I'm gonna go down this one because you know it's, it's just yeah. It's good. Just go this. Go down this one. He's bigger. Also, the painter's moved in. Hope he's happy. I'm actually gonna go visit him. And I'm gonna buy the pylon from him. He's probably selling it. I know. I I know. I won't be able to use the pylon, but at least I'm gonna be able to buy it. So yeah. I won't be able to use it, but at least I can buy it. Just buy it. So it's already bought, and then we're gonna be able to use it when more NPCs move in. So probably after defeating, you know, Queen Bee, we're gonna have the witch doctor. Anyway, hey dude. Yeah. This is such a mess. Yo, Leonardo. Yeah. Shop. Sell me, yeah, there it is, the jungle pylon. This one costs 8 gold, 50 silver. Pretty expensive, huh? Whatever. Actually, check in your happiness, yeah. 
If the serene living space is all quiet, I need to focus on my mural. There are ingredients for mixing new paint in the jungle and pretty view on her life. Okay, so he's happy. Any shop, give me the jungle pile and thank you. That caused me quite a bit, but fine. Let's go and put this down right here. Nice. The jungle pylon. Nice, so now we have, yeah, we have three pylons. The beautiful jungle one, desert one, and then the forest one. Unfortunately, this one doesn't work because we don't have enough people living here. But that's still pretty cool. Whatever. Let's get out of here. Oh, stop. Oh, my God. Stop. Die, 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 die. Close the door behind me. Okay. Let's go into the de into the jungle now. Yeah, I've wasted 20 minutes of this episode just building a house and getting killed. Oh, stop. How many times have I died already? No. Oh, once. Never mind. <laughs> this is actually not that bad. Anyway, um, yeah. Let's now go explore the underground desert and explore the underground jungle. Let's quickly go and see what we can find. And then we can finish off. And next episode, we can explore the desert. We can explore the jungle. We can pretty much do more underground exploring. And then soon, we can build an arena and fight the Alcafudu. Good. Now, it's so dark down here. Oh, my God. Let's quickly switch helmets so you can see something. Good. Now, I'm going to have way less defense. I'm going to have way less defense. I have, yeah. I lose six defense. With this helmet, I lose six defense, but I can see. I think I prefer to see rather than just be a bit stronger. So let's, yeah, let's just yeah, explore this place. Anyway, I found one of these weird trees over here. That's quite good. We can see what we can find inside. These journey, they don't journey have good stuff. Well, they don't journey have great stuff, but they always have something. Let's just see what we can find inside of here, shall we? Yeah. And this little house. Good. Alright, now, where the hell is the entrance? It's a good question. Oh, it's not even over here. This one big strange tree that I just cut through down through the middle. I believe the entrance should be somewhere out here. This is one strange jungle. Where is the entrance to this tree? This is a huge tree. Holy moly. I haven't actually seen the one this big in a long while. Okay. Where is the center part? I want to go and find the chest that's inside. Okay. Let, let, you know, let's just dig through it until we find something. My pickaxe ain't actually that good. I need to also get a new pickaxe. Anyway, there it is. Yeah, the center. I was actually quite close. No, mind. I was nowhere close to the center. <laughs> and this is it. The center of the tree. Journey's always a chest down here. Sometimes it has good loot, sometimes it doesn't. What do we have here? Oh, staff of regrowth. It's literally the worst item we can get. All this does is just regrows dirt. It's cool, but useless. And yeah, it loots the rest. Nice. And I can take the chest. Good. Now. Good, 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 good. That's a pretty good find. Well, no, the find's you. The find useless. The item that he found is useless, but it's still pretty cool that he found it. And now, let's really get out of here. I keep on getting stuck on something. No, oh my god. Okay, snatchers, slimes, oh god, so much stuff down here, so much scary stuff, piranhas as well, oh my god, stop, die, die, I end up good or something, I end up like, I need a weapon, I need something that can kill these fools quite quickly, and easily, and, oh god, whatever, also, because the painter moved into the jungle, we have one more free space in the cactus house, which is quite cool, we can go and have someone move in there soon. Probably like in the arms he can move in probably first. And then, you know, uh, the steampunk is going to move in, well, later. Anyway, whatever. There's a bunch of slimes in the jungle. I don't know why, but yeah. A bunch of slimes. All very dangerous. Highly lethal. Highly annoying. Whatever. Let's see what else we can find in this beautiful jungle, shall we? Yeah. Good. Uh, some gold over here, but I don't need gold anymore. I'm past my gold mining years. Okay. I would uh, I would blow this up. Actually, I have a scar bomb, don't I? Let's go and use that scar bomb. That's still left over from my desert adventure. Nice. I like those scar bombs. Very cool. Very helpful as well. Good. Now. This is one big tree. Holy moly. All right. Oh, a uh, life crystal. Good. I was kind of, you know, hoping we'd find some because I'm kind of... My health is not that high. So the more life crystals, the better. All right, good. Jungles are very rewarding, but also very dangerous. You can find a lot of good stuff here. But the chances of you dying are very high. Whatever. Anyway, there's another chest down there. Anyway, 220 health. Now we go up to, boom, 240. Great. So as I said, jungle, very cool, very rewarding, but also very dangerous. What do you have inside of here? Precise Hermes boots. Already got those, but you can sell those. Thanks. Everything else, yeah, useless, but cheers. Give me that. All right. But that's a bit of a useless chest, but that's still fine. Now our life crystal. Nice. As I said, rewarding, but highly lethal. Whatever. That's fine. Let's see what else can we find here, huh? Go and use that to get all these out of the way. Good. Nice. Hello, how do you do, Mr. Piranha? Stop, stop, die. Give me life crystal. Nice. Now, from 240 health, we go to... Boom! 260. We're getting quite close to max health. That's quite good. Well, max is pretty hard one. You can get more in hard mode. Whatever. That's fine. Shurikens, I need those. They're actually pretty bad. Oh, no. I just let the bees out. Oh, God. Run, run, run. Jungle spores might need those. Actually, that's not a jungle spore. That's a jungle chest thing, Majiga. Oh, that's cool. That's a shrine, yeah. I saw the green light and thought it was a jungle, um, chest. I mean, no, no. 
I thought the green, not I thought it was a jungle spore. Because jungle spores shine bright green. So I thought it was a jungle spore. It's not, it's not a jungle spore. It's a shrine. It's quite good because shrines are actually quite nice. They do have quite decent stuff. So hell yeah, we found a shrine. That's quite good. And also we found a snatcher, which is quite dangerous. So you go and kill this dude. And let's make our way into the shrine so we can find. But yeah, cool. So yeah. Actually, what's the opposite of disappointment? I literally just had this, I just had the opposite of disappointment. Because I thought it was just like a standard. Oh my god, what is that? It's a pink fairy. Ah, get away from me. No. Oh, it's a fairy. It's a, it's, it's a, okay, cool. Okay, where are you leading me, huh? Where are you leading me? Okay. So you're leading me. Okay, yeah, don't worry. I'm coming, pink fairy. Cool. Yeah, so these are, these are the fairies. They're new. These are new and these, like, take you places. These can, like, lead you to valuable stuff. Are you leading me to the shrine? Because if you lead me to the shrine, I'm going to be quite mad. Yeah, you're leading me to the shrine. Well, thank you, fairy. That's useless. I didn't need that, but yeah, thanks. That's cool. She just led me to the thing. That's quite nice. I didn't need her because I could see the shrine perfectly well, but that's still pretty fine. Pretty sweet. Shows you that at least someone cares for you in this world. Whatever. The shrine is protected by two snipers. Some of them is going to go in there, get the items from uh, from there, and just run. Because frankly, I don't really feel like fighting these guys. They are quite dangerous. Okay, yeah. Uh, okay, one of those anklets, they're actually pretty useless, but cool. Give me that. Give me that. Yeah, no, I said give me that. No. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, run, run. Okay, what did you get? We got an anklet. We got a few bombs. Potions. Yeah, generally, it's the main thing that we got. 10% increased movement speed, that's useless. We do have the steps too, but I don't know if I use that, so let's maybe go and let's put it on. The faster we are, the better. Steps to you're cool, but I don't know if I use you. Alright, whatever. That's that. Let's see what else can we find here. Oh no, a hornet. Hornets are also very dangerous. Nobody likes hornets. A hornet is a man's worst. Oh, stop. Nightmare. Stop. Oh my god. Oh, ah. Jesus Christ. Okay, let's quickly make ourselves some sticky bombs. I can make sticky grenades. And let's say, uh, yeah, let's quickly just. Blow up, blow our way down. I don't feel like digging to explode the place. Explosions always okay. That's not gonna work. The ground is a bit too. Yeah, that doesn't lead to anywhere. Okay, we gotta find a different spot. And also gotta kill this hornet. Stop! Don't poison me. Thank you. Let's get out of there. Okay, now stop. There's so many hornets. I, the hornets are so dangerous. I hate the hornets. Like I hate them. They are so bad. I think everyone hates them. Because the point. Right, nice. A new point. I didn't. I our part. We don't actually need to use the bomb. Right, cool. What do we have down here, huh? We have. Okay, a lot of stuff. We have our fall damage. Do you guys? Uh, yeah. Thing Jigger. Nice. Yeah, nice. Beautiful life crystal. Hell yeah. I'm running out of space made inventory. Nice. Boom! 280 health. That's very good. Very, very good indeed. Now, why do I have a different... Okay, no, okay whatever. Never, never mind me. <coughs> oh, I'm gonna die here. Now, um, I need myself a... What are... Well, yeah. Healing potion. Good. Don't know where that came from. Probably from a pot. Okay, now. Oh, look what we found. We have found the desert. What is it? No, not the desert. The jungle temple. Yeah, actually, found this jungle temple. We can't actually access it yet, but yeah, cool. We found it. This, my friends, is the jungle temple. I think everybody knows what this is. It's a pretty cool place. You know, it's just jungle temple. Yay, cool. Woohoo. And yeah, we can only access this as. We can only access this after we defeat Plantera, so I cannot do anything with this yet, but it's cool that we found it, because sometimes finding these is quite difficult, so yeah, cool, we found ours, that's pretty good. Now we'd have to go and spend five years searching for one. Anyway, let's see what else can we find in this jungle, huh? We have a few minutes left, let's go do more exploring, see what we can find, then I guess we can finish off soon. And next episode we can go, we can explore the- oh yeah, look, there's some light inside of there. Okay, which one is the- which way is the entrance? Yeah, sir, lead me. Where's the entrance? Is that the ins Where's the entrance? Is that the inside? Is that the entrance? I think that is the inside or the entrance. I don't know, but that is the door that we have to unlock to get in. Anyway, um, yeah, cool. As I was saying, next episode. Yeah, this isn't this isn't the right way. Next episode, what we're going to do is we're going to go and do some more um uh, exploring. Yes, we're going to we're going to do some more exploring. So yeah, I'll get up. Yes, I'm saying. Ladies and gentlemen, next episode you can do some more exploring, most likely, even more specifically, we're gonna go and explore the... Wait, is this the inside of the temple or is this the outside of the temple? Because I'm so confused. I wanna try to find the entrance. I don't wanna find a place that I can go. Whatever. Uh, yeah, next episode we're gonna explore the desert, we can explore the underground jungle. Yeah. We can carry and explore on this place, and we can carry and explore on this place down here, because I haven't explored those fully, and I wanna explore those a bit more. So, ladies and gentlemen, next episode we're gonna go, we're gonna explore underground desert, underground jungle, we're gonna explore both those a bit more. And we're gonna have a fun time. That's gonna be quite good. And then, yeah, soon we're gonna fight the Eye of Cthulhu. We're gonna have fun with all that stuff. And yeah, it's gonna be good. Now, um, yeah. Hey, how do you do? Uh, you're annoying me, which is quite bad. 
I just want to go and just explore a bit more, see if we can find anything interesting. See if we can find the entrance to this goddamn temple and the, yeah. And yeah, those down here, those are the jungle sports. I followed that up so earlier. Okay, I'm going to run out of mana soon, which ain't good. Because out of mana, I'm pretty, you know, useless. Okay, yeah, stop. Yeah, I'm going to die. Can you also die, bro? Yeah, I kind of need to get out of here. Stop, stop. Yeah, like, stop, bro. No, stop, 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 stop. No, 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 okay. Code red, we are going to die. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, no, die. Oh, my God. Okay. Scarion digging. Yes, yeah, there's a temple. Cool, but I don't think I can find the entrance. I don't know if the entrance is anywhere near here. Where is the entrance to the temple? Is this the entrance? No, stop. Ah, no, stop. Dig, 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 dig. No, the entrance ain't here. I don't know where the entrance is. I don't care about the entrance. Oh, my God. No, stop, stop. Uh, can you uh, just kill it? Kill it. It's a spike jungle slime. These guys, these are very dangerous. No, kill it. Ah, kill it. No, I'm going to die. Oh my god. Okay, wow, we. Yes, it. The jungle's very dangerous. I don't know if I'm strong enough to survive this place, to be honest. It's a very dangerous place. Oh, that was just drop a bomb down here. Oh god, oh my god. Okay. Let's go on digging. Yeah, let's get a bit further. I guess we can finish off the episode very soon. Okay, let's also kill you while we can. There you are. Okay, good now. Oh my god, damn it. Well. That's two gold gone and wasted. I'll never see again. Why? Because I'm not going back there. Hoo hoo. No, no, no. Well, yeah, I guess that's that. That is that. We are that. We have died. We're dead. Everything's quite bad. Yeah, cool. That's my money down there. I know I've lost some money, but frankly, I don't care. I have few silver only. I have, you know, that much money. That's enough. Why are you in here? Whatever. I guess. Yeah, that's that. Lane, gentlemen. What a crazy episode. I guess, yeah, I think we have indeed run out of time today, so we're going to have to go and we're going to finish it. We're going to, uh, we're going to have to finish off right here because, ladies and gentlemen, we have indeed run out of time. Let's quickly go fill up our um, yeah, storage room a bit more, more chests. There we are, nice. Uh, storage room's not full. It's not full. We already got, you know, all the chests placed there. That's pretty nice. Anyway, um, let's, yeah, clear our inventory, clear out our inventory, and yeah. Also, we gotta expand our house. Keep on forgetting, but I wanna expand my house. It's pretty small. I wanna expand it to here and then up a bit. But we can do that also later. We got so much to do. So much to do. I wanna go and start de dealing with all that stuff soon. I also got a green torch. Oh, God. Well, I'm gonna... Uh, what should I do with this torch? You know, I'm just gonna go and put this all the way up... Yeah, I'm gonna put it all the way up here. Why? Because why not have a green torch on top of a tree? Boom. Okay, there we go. Beautiful. That is generally beautiful. We have a torch on a tree. Nice. Any other crop I can sell? Yeah, let's quickly go visit our merchant. Why are why have you switched homes? Yeah, I haven't. Okay, that's good. Anyway, yeah, you, Barney. Um, yeah, you can go and take um, this. And you can also go and take that. And that. And I'm going to keep a step stool. Take that. And take that. And just, just that, that. There we are. Thank you. And I can go and use these to decorate this home. Nice. Beautiful. Decoration. Alright, now let's go and yeah. I had some silt, didn't I? I didn't mean to dump the silt. Actually, no, I didn't like, even pick it up. That's fine. Now let's go dump our money away. There we are. Quick that away. And now ores. We can go and... We don't have any ores. Potions. Yeah, potions can go into here. Good. I need an equipment chest. I really do. Building items, herbs. This can be equipment. Rename. Yeah, this dead man's chest is going to be the equipment. Nice. Equipment. Nice. I also need a weapons chest, but that's fine. Equipment. Good. And yeah, the steps tools, in fact, equipment, we're gonna go and put that into here right now. Building items, you are building items. And uh, yeah, we can swap our helmet. Yeah, that's that, I guess. Anyway, yeah, what the hell did you just do, Bradley? <laughs> anyway, yeah, that is that. Ladies and gentlemen, why is my defense so low? Oh, the steps tool, of course. The steps tool gave me a bonus for defense. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if I really want this anklet, because this anklet, yes, it does give me, you know. Increased movement. So I move a tiny bit faster, but I do get more defense with the. I get more defense with the steps to it, and I do like defense. Let's really compare these two. Because this makes me faster and gives me more defense. Let's see. Do I want speed or do I want defense? How fast do I move? Yeah, I move pretty fast. How about, you know, how much slow do I move? I guess it's considerable. You know, it's actually not that bad, actually. Yeah, I don't see a difference. We're gonna keep that step suit because step suit not only makes me cool, but also gives me, you know, some extra. I love step suit. Not only doesn't, not only doesn't make me cool, but also gives me extra defense, which I also like that. Anyway, charge god, we can fight that guy later. Flaming mace, I'm gonna go and do that. I'm gonna upgrade my mace to the flaming mace because I just want the flaming mace. Boom, we got it. Nice. Now our mace is the flaming mace. It's a little bit cooler. Yeah. So yeah. In other words, you have a new mace. It's a bit cooler, a bit bigger, a bit yeah, cool. 
We have a new weapon, the flaming mace. You upgraded that. And I have 66 torches. Great. What a number. Palpatine's gonna come here soon. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in the next episode. Where next episode we're going to go. We're going to head back into the jungle. We're gonna explore the jungle more. We're gonna head back into the desert. We're gonna explore the desert. Somebody, and I'm simply gonna be exploring these two. Desert jungle, we're gonna explore both those caves. We're also gonna get back to our caves and start heading to the underworld so we can go and build a home for the demolitionist. And I also wanna explore the underground uh, uh, icy biome. I also wanna go and explore the snow biome, the underground of that. There's a lot to do. I also wanna go and you know, head into the crimson and prepare for the battle of the brain of Cthulhu. I'm not saying that we're gonna fight him, but we're simply prepare to get ourselves ready. I also wanna go build an arena in the desert. And also, I want to go and fight the Eye of Cthulhu very soon, so the arena can go right here. And yeah, the battle with the Eye of Cthulhu is going to be very soon. There's much to do, so journey, yeah. Next episode, we're going to go explore underground desert, underground jungle. Soon, we can make our way to the underworld and explore the icy biome. And I guess you can probably fight the Eye of Cthulhu also very soon. So yeah, next episode, primary targets, desert, jungle. And then, I guess, in the next few episodes, underworld, snow biome, Eye of Cthulhu. And, and also, Brain of Cthulhu. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. The torch up there looks very cool, makes the trees look... Well, okay, I actually don't think I really like that. Well, yeah, it's cool, but makes the trees look less natural, you know. Just give me that. How does it look without it? It looks pretty dark up there, to be honest. Yeah, pretty dark trees. That's a very tall tree. Maybe I can put it up here. Yeah, like, up top, like, on the top of this tree. I can't, that's a bit of a shame. Well, you can put it over there. Looks a bit better over there, I presume. How about I put it on the right side? Yeah. Give me a minute, I'm just playing with a goddamn torch. On here, does, does it look better over there? Uh, yeah, I guess a tiny bit. It looks like a bit of like a beacon, I guess. A bit of a uh, beacon. That looks pretty cool. Anyway, as I said, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Next episode, exploring desert, exploring jungle, and then soon, burn of Cthulhu, I have Cthulhu, icy biome, underworld. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!